we have a wonderful reason to celebrate. We're welcoming another company, HempRise, into the One Southern Indiana family of businesses. It's the day One Southern Indiana President Wendy Dant Chesser has been waiting two years for. Tangible results from the region's newest $80 million facility, a hemp processing and manufacturing plant that's unlike any other in the country. You've got a great company, a long future, a leader in its industry, a foreign company that is making an investment in our community, and and a product that has lots of potential. That product is hemp. It can be used to create a number of common everyday products like skin and hair care. HempRise will be breaking down that plant. And we want to be at the forefront of that in southern Indiana. After getting the green light from the state, construction began on a tank farm where the plants will be extracted. 20 months later, these 12 tanks are up and running, meaning construction here at HempRise is now complete. Soon the company will be able to create enough product to make them one of the, if not the largest, hemp processing and manufacturing facilities in the country. Kentucky and Indiana grow some of the best hemp in the country. We felt like this region of the country really provides us with so much more opportunity for growth and development. This is where we really wanted to focus our time, energy, and investment. When the company hits its stride, officials expect to process somewhere between 8 and 10 million pounds of hemp each year, enough to support southern Indiana farmers and make the region a hotbed for hemp. At the end of the day, we're here to provide an ingredient that is then useful in consumer products for other companies. It's one step at a time, it's one consumer at a time, one brand at a time, and we're really looking forward to, uh, to making that happen. In Jeffersonville, Manoj Kungwari, WLKY News.